I'm a rock mechanical engineer with a copper mine in Mount Isa in Queensland. Part of Extrata Copper's international business. Oh, well, I said every day is different, every role is different. I've been in about five different jobs since I've been here, so it's been a good experience. It's definitely a steep learning curve from day one, where you're thrown not necessarily into the deep end, but looking after a lot of operations, a lot of responsibility, and a fair bit of pressure to go with it. But uh, no, I've loved it. So I always liked geography, I guess, in, uh, in high school. I, um, I completed Year 11 Geology in Year 10, and it was in Year 10 that um, we had to do work experience in high school. So I spent, or I went to my careers advisor and said, I like geography and I'm doing pretty well in uh, maths and science. Uh, where can I go, what can I do? And he sorted out work experience with a, a firm, uh, the State Water Board, I think it was, um, in rural Victoria. And um, I spent two weeks as a hydrographical engineering assistant, which sounds interesting. So I spent a couple of weeks taking uh, borehole samples and stream, stream water flow samples and those sorts of things. Taking that data back to the, uh, back to the laboratory, analysing it. And uh, yeah, so basically spent half my time out in the field, half my time in the office and, and found that was kind of the career I wanted to get into, I guess, out in the field. The course that I went into was geological engineering. And I guess throughout that geoengineering degree, I did at RMIT. Um, I spent a fair bit of my vacation work working out in the field in the minerals industry. I guess that was, that was luck in the end, but also uh, it seemed the most exciting at the time. So. I guess the skills you need is you've got to be committed and you've got to be passionate. You've got to be uh, dedicated to your job. Uh, good communication skills are certainly important. I guess the ability to work in a team or, or lead a team, those sorts of skills. And outgoing, I guess, as well. The career I'm into now certainly allows me to get out and explore Australia, which is something I'd never be able to do if I was stuck in a city somewhere. Certainly, yeah, there's plenty of opportunity to go overseas, and that's within my company and plenty of others. That's right, there's uh, rock mechanics uh, positions all over the world. I know friends that are there. What do I like about the minerals industry? Well, what can I say? It's fairly dynamic, every day is different. It's exciting, it's challenging, and certainly it's rewarding at the end of the day where you can see what you've done come into fruition and you can see the benefits and the successes, I guess, of your work. 